AI is making huge strides today. DBS Bank uses AI during audit to predict and identify branches that are at a higher risk. They are also developing predictive tools for flesh estimates of balance sheet, income and expenses. But AI systems can go rogue or be used in unethical ways. Imagine if a social score for every citizen is implemented based on your online activities. That score is then used to determine your credit worthiness or your integrity as a job candidate or your eligibility for public services. Is that fair? What if that data is being manipulated? If a driverless car crashes into another driverless car, who is at fault? Imagine if all stock trading systems in the world are run on AI. If an AI system detects that stock exchange indices are dropping, it could start selling stocks. Other systems could pick up on this pattern. This could spiral into panic selling, leading to a crash. Does AI need to be regulated urgently? Or should regulation be relaxed so as not to stifle innovation? In Singapore, there is no intention of rushing into AI regulation. At this stage, it is more important to start the conversation about the governance framework for AI. The Monetary Authority of Singapore is working with stakeholders to develop a guide to promote the responsible and ethical use of AI by financial institutions. An advisory council on the ethical use of AI and data will work with the Infocom Media Development Authority on the responsible development of AI. The Personal Data Protection Commission has released a discussion paper on how a possible AI and data governance framework could look like. Microsoft has formed a cross-company team to recommend programs, policies and best practices on AI safety, fairness, transparency and ethics. Human accountants are still needed for their exercise of professional skepticism. AI depends on the quality and integrity of the data it is fed with. Accountants are needed to look out for evidence of fraud that may elude an AI algorithm and guard against data manipulation. We can prepare for system failure that could harm users by planning for scenarios based on past usage patterns and known vulnerabilities in humans and technology and then determine what outcomes to avoid. Ultimately, knowledge sharing between regulators and industries is the best shot we have at ensuring the ethical use of AI without stifling innovation.